Breaking news. Uh, guys, somebody has been arrested and this uh, there's an article that was released on the 22nd of June 2024. Now, this person who was arrested, who has been arrested, was arrested over a video he made on TikTok saying that Ramaphosa must be removed. Um, you know what I'm saying? He was speaking about things like that, right? Uh, this article, is gonna, you're going to find it on News24 by Alex Mecher. So I think I need to show you in the screen. I did told, tell, look, I did made a video about that. And I said to people, people, uh, there are people that are going to be arrested, right? Why people are going to be arrested is because some of the people that are going to be arrested, it's not that there's substantial evidence against them, but they will be easy target, right? Some, okay, yeah, some, they might be arrested for something with evidence, right? So I, I did tell you guys that people are going to be arrested. I hope you now understand where I was coming from. Uh, this person was arrested for saying that Ramaphosa must be removed. Uh, and then, uh, like the hawks are saying, he was in look like, inciting violence because of that. And out of that, the man must be arrested. It is not long ago where I said that. I said, anybody that supports MK Party, they are under a microscopical eye. Every word that they shall utter, or anybody that any word that we shall utter, uh, will be taken into account. Me doing this video, people are looking at anything and everything. You know what I'm saying? Uh, is he saying that uh, people must fight, people must protest? You know what, 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 what is it? You know, like I'm telling you, each and every word that comes from my mouth counts. That I know, right? And I was made aware, I was, I've been informed that you can't say anything. Uh, these people, they want to arrest most of the channels, that are on people who are on TikTok, YouTube, anybody that seems to be Zuma, pro-Zuma, any word that they can use against you will be taken, will be, you will be arrested. I'm telling you now, you will be arrested. So you should not be doing that by now. You know what I'm saying? Eh... Uh, I did say that to people, uh, just right, just like now, everything is now coming to fold. Then, mind you, okay, you say that on a TikTok, then they go to your TikTok, they trace you and everything about you, and they get your location, and they come and arrest you. And uh, it's not just any police; it's hawks. Hawks, get guys. Uh, we we know that. Uh, look, we we, we 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 look. They are classified as people who are investigating prioritized crime, criminal activity. In this YouTube channel, again, guys, we are not investigating anything, but we are in pursuit of the truth. That is why you need to do this. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people, because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge, and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the Super Thanks Party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay so having said that uh but i must correct myself when i say we are not investigating anything we are investigating the truth right we are questioning everything but from the statement that I've received so far, the two people who have read the article, because I'm not a paying member in this uh, look, uh, newsroom, what, what, uh, because what I also hate is the fact that you all know that in newsroom, Afri look, in News24, sorry, not Newsroom Africa, in News24, it daily maverick, uh, the citizen, I forgot the other ones. We all know every article that comes from these people, you can almost tell that it's anti-Zoom, 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 right? So 
that is what actually create the imbalance here to say ah this media house is nah 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 nah, nah, nah. they are a big no so uh so to me i i i i i i, I don't, i'm not a paying member because again <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I would have loved them to give me fair and balanced news, but that's not actually what is happening so far. With that being said, uh, what does it tell you about the fact that um, maybe, maybe one will ask you, will argue and say, we need to find that video. Um, if, for instance, I can locate the court I just want to go to that court and look at how this, the evidence that will be presented in that court. I want to hear that video. If anybody, if anyone, guys, uh, know, look, look, know the video, please, or if you are in position of the video, please share the video. I'm super keen because I'm interested to, 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 to hear words of inciting violence in that video. Or if you are a paying member, then can you kindly unlock the article then and maybe find the video for us because we are not a paying member. Uh, I'm not a paying member, not we. I'm not a paying member. So can you kindly find this article for us and let's let's hear what the article has got to say. Maybe they, look at the, because they've got the muscle of investigative journalism there. So I think... I think... The look at the, the look at the mice they might have gotten the video, so yeah, that's another way of getting the video. You need to get hold of this article here and open the article. Probably they might have put the link there and let's watch the video together, guys. So I'm interested to see that evidence. I'm interested to to know what did he say that incited violence. But what what we know is that. He was displeased about Ramaphosa being the president of this country. He wanted him to be removed. And uh, yeah, yeah. So it's just one of those things. He wanted him to be removed. Ramaphosa must be removed. That is what he said there. So the question is, if he said that, how did he incite violence? Maybe that's what we will try. That's what we were trying to look or, uh, get right now. Good. Out of his words. In his own words, what did he? Yeah, man. Yeah, that's why you hear me. I'm stuttering because I'm still trying to figure out the word Ramaphosa must be removed. Does it in? Does it mean uh, one is inciting violence, or there's more than that? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe again, if you are a lawyer, this is your field. You need to give us some opinion. So what I'm going to do, I know a lot of lawyers. Uh, I will try to get the video from this person. I want to know. I'm very keen. I want to know. Out of the words uttered by this person, what did he say that amounts to violence? You know why I'm, I'm keen to, 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 to know things like that? You will remember July, during the July uh, civil unrest, if you remember perfectly, a lot of people were arrested. And uh, one of the persons that got arrested as well, it is none other than Ngizwa Mkono. Uma Tlingwane got arrested. And as a result, uh, look, he got arrested for, what, what did he say? And then they said, do you remember that? They said that uh, his words amounted to, uh, amounted to what type of violence, right? Okay, no problem. Fast forward. He has been attending the case, the, 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 uh, his case in Ranbek Magistrate Court. He was then uh, told that he cannot move between province until the case is finalized. So he couldn't travel. He will attend the case in Gauteng and back when he could look and go back to case at end. That's what he will do, right? Then the 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 the, 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 the final day comes, and then the court says and found that. Actually, he said nothing that amounts to what he's been accused of. A lot of people got arrested, but few convictions. We know that just prior to our elections, one look one was one of two or three people got got convicted of that. Um, if I'm not mistaken, one man was sentenced to twelve years, uh, like imprisonment for 
inciting for inciting violence uh, now that he is convicted so we can say so that he incited violence but abong gizo for instance they are out because there was never an evidence that they look incited violence things like that makes me ask wonder is this man arrested on the basis of evidence or what <laughs>